Hi, Zach Pater here, River Valley Marine in Red Wing, Minnesota. And if you love superior quality, affordable, but nice, high quality boats, take a look at this. This here is a 75 Egg Harbor 33 convertible, also known as their Sport Fisherman. A very cool boat. Front to back, inside and out, this boat has character. It is a 100% freshwater boat um since new that is and it's got documentation uh beyond belief but take a look at some cool stuff on this boat for its age it's got really neat teak walk arounds big flat deck love the windlass with the big anchor and chain lots of flaring out the front of this boat you look down it and the ride quality is second to none for a boat this size Obviously, the overall build quality is substantial just based on the style and design of the boat. Nice big walk-arounds. Gonna work our way to the back. You do got a full windshield here or window across the front. Nice big side windows. Love that beautiful framework done with the full enclosure. Uh, nice top on that is absolutely, I just love the boat. It's a boat I've known for many, many years and uh, just a, a great setup here. Work our way to the back. You have a lot of that traditional teak. There is a grill. Dinghy is available. Uh, additional fee to that. Nice ladder going up to the bridge. The woodwork, generally speaking, is very, very nice. The wood's been kept up very well. The exterior wood could use a uh, recode, a little bit of a refinish. But the size of this cockpit and the overall condition is phenomenal. From there, let's take a closer look inside. All right, so we're going to jump inside the cabin and look at this massive door setup. You have double sliding doors just making this huge entryway where truly the exterior of the boat becomes the interior and vice versa. You go inside in that wide beam. For a 33-foot boat, this boat's exceptionally wide. You do have a lower helm. Obviously, this is all wide open, so you could really do what you want from a furnishing standpoint. What you see here is coming with the boat. The blinds are all new, which are very nice, and it's got the nice cover over the front. Work your way in. You can obviously see carpeting and things like that have been updated. The woodwork interior-wise is very, very nice. Love the array of gauges, all crisp and clean looking. The boat does have generator and air conditioning and heat. The air and heat unit was just new last year. Work our way forward and you'll see the air and heat controls right there as you enter or go down the steps into the galley. Speaking of the galley, you can go down the steps right here and your galley is just off to the port side. Nice stainless sink, two burner cooktop, good storage down below and up top. And again, your galley from a little different angle and then the refrigerator, obviously an updated Norcold 110 12 volt fridge. Very, very nicely set in there to really complete this galley. Work our way forward and you've actually got a very sizable forward berth in this boat. Again, beautiful trim work. Um, it can either be set up as a, a V bed, if you will, or as it is now, the full single bed. And as you work your way inside, you can see the woodwork is very, very nice. No leaks to see anywhere within the boat. And again, in here it's a little dark, so a little hard to see in video, but overall a very nice forward stateroom. Can't leave the inside of the boat without looking at the head because the head is very light and airy. Love the skylight up above there. You do have your head over here, nice vanity, some storage, your sink, and it does have the ability to be a shower as well in here, all draining down and pumping overboard. Last but not least, let's take a look at the bridge. Let's start by looking at all that nice canvas up here. That is a beautiful top that has been built for this boat. Um, I don't recall exactly when it was installed. 2016 rings a bell, but the canvas is very, very nice. Now from there, you do get a fair amount of seating. You got back-to-back -back seats, port and starboard with a nice big uh, center-mounted helm seat and a very sharp-looking dash. VHF radio, stereo controls, updated array of gauges with fuel scans. Just a good looking setup. This boat is mechanically very, very solid. All your array of switches underneath there. Visibility is phenomenal when you're driving this boat. You can really see out the front very nice. And as you turn around, you can see the back of the boat when backing down. So just overall a good looking setup. The seats themselves are in good shape. No major cuts or tears to speak of. Just generally speaking, a very good looking bridge on this Egg Harbor. 
So that there is a quick video walk around to this Egg Harbor, a boat that certainly for its age should not disappoint. A very good value, a very nice boat, a boat with a lot of heritage and history. Just a very good looking setup. Again, I'm Zach Pater here at River Valley Marine, River Valley Power and Sport in Red Wing, Minnesota, and I appreciate you taking the time to view our video.